Marty Adler. The horses in today's final of the Wolverine Futurity all had to qualify in earlier races. They had to finish in the first four of two elimination heats. Now here's the post parade of the finalists for the Wolverine Futurity. Number one is field officer owned by Alexander and Catherine Sellers of Edwardsburg, the driver Charles Taylor. Two is Toy Soldier. Owned by John Grozinski of Clarkson, Michigan, Brad Kramer is in the sulky. Three is Star Brew, owned by Foxgate Farms and C. Young, and along with Connie Boschma. Connie does a training. The driver will be Carl Putnam, Jr. The number four horse is Joe Slick, owned by Jamison Turner of Sault Ste. Marie. The driver, Peter Rand. Five is Turbo Rabbit, owned by Faro and Wright from Commerce Township. The trainer is Clay Faro and the driver, Mark Webster. Number six is Butch's Date, owned by Marshall and Lois Field of Rochester Hills, Michigan. Troy Boring is in the bike. Seven is Set for Life, owned by Ada Jean Ackerman. That's D.R. Ackerman in the sulky. And the eight horse is Royal Navy. Royal Navy is owned by Walter Bird and Jack Cooper of South Lyon. Marty Cooper They're now in the hands the of the starter. They're moving off the turn. They're into the stretch. And let's turn it over to track announcer here at the Ottawa County Fair, Brett Boyd, for the call. And here they come. They're off and pacing a Calvary charge off that gate. And in the center of the track, Star Brew charges out for the lead. Troy Soldier fired out on the inside in second. Star Brew goes off stride into the turn. And now taking over that lead, it's Toy Soldier on the inside. Field officer is second. Star Brew sets back on the pace in third. Royal Navy is fourth. Here comes Joe Slick with a tap of the whip. Peter Renz got him in motion. Second over in fourth. Moving up on the outside, Turbo Rabbit is fifth, set for life, and Butch's date trail. They were rocking and rolling the quarter, 28 and two. And it's Brad Kramer and Toy Soldier with the lead. Star Brew goes off stride again. And now on the outside, here comes Field Officer. They spin off the turn and come into the half. And Joe Slick gladly catches that cover. He's second over in fourth. Royal Navy is shifted up and right with them there in third. Turbo Rabbit right behind the action in fourth, set for life. Off stride in fifth as they pace by the half, 57 and four. Around the turn, Mr. Kramer goes to work. It's Toy Soldiers drawn off by two. Royal Navy, he's dreaming of an upset. Right there in second. On the outside, field officer is third. And Turbo Rabbit fourth. Joe Slick is locked up in fifth. It's anybody's race with a quarter to go. Toy Soldier with the lead. Can you believe it? Field officer is coming back. On the outside, three quarters, 126 and three. Royal Navy is third. Turbo Rabbit on the outside, fourth. They turn for home. Toy Soldier, field officer on the outside. Royal Navy at the rail. They're driving for home. And it's Toy Soldier. He's going to get the job done. Toy Soldier. What a strong performance by Toy Soldier with Brad Kramer in the bike holding off the number one horse, field officer. Strong performance from field officer as well. We were told earlier he needed to get down to the rail in order to win this one. Well, he had a tough, tough trip on the outside. And up for third was the number eight horse, Royal Navy, with Marty Cooper in the bike. More right after this from the Ottawa County Fair.